tension remains high in Forole village, North Hor, Masabit County, after the recent killing of 11 people who were on a peace-seeking mission over strained relationships as a result of fast depleting resources. Now, the residents of the ordinarily quiet town are ready to pack up their all and leave if a speedy solution is not found as they find their lives in fear or make that constant fear. Raquel Mwigai has the details. Wheels of pain over the loss of a loved one rent the morning air in Forole village, Marsabit County, which is just a few kilometers off the Kenya-Ethiopia border. <laughs> the recent lapse in security has altered what used to be a silent but peaceful life for this residents. <laughs> Numbers in Forale Primary School shrinking as parents keep children away with the school's boarding facility yet to open over security concerns. We had enrollment of 320. Now the enrollment has dropped from 320 to 200 people. Uh, we don't know where they have gone. The major cause of the conflict remains always present, unlike the peace they so long for. Past and future political factors, tribal animosity, scarcity of resources and firearms illegally held by civilians being among the web of reasons given for the cause of killings. It's not about tribal or clan clashes. This is actually purely about land issue. I know the Ethiopians who have been settled in, in the country against the will of the locals around. This matter is known to the national government and it's the duty of the national government to protect people on, on, on the border and to protect its own border itself. But as they bury their dead under the safety of the daylight, their minds are filled with anxiety over the terror that awaits when darkness sets in. Theirs is to hope that when dawn comes, it will not come with morning.